Chris, we just heard from Malik. We just heard from De'Aaron. They were the stars tonight. What is your takeaway from their performances and what you saw tonight as a whole? that this stage isn't too big for them. This was their first playoff game for both of them. Of course, De'Aaron Fox, he spent his entire career here in Sacramento, and he was part of that, the first five years of his career, part of that 16-year playoff drought, and he comes out and he puts up 38 points on the defending champs, out-dueling Stephen Curry, and then his college teammate, one of his best friends, a guy that he was instrumental in bringing to Sacramento this offseason, Malik Monk, putting up another 30 points with him, 32 for him, as you said, a combined 70 points from those two helping this team light the beam. Now let's take you up and show you that beam, a rallying point for the city of Sacramento and for this team all season long. Fans not able to chant light the beam before the end of the game because this was in doubt until the final seconds. The Warriors had the ball while they were down just one. They put up a couple of shots. None of them were able to fall. The Kings got the rebound at the end. Malik Monk able to put the game away at the free throw line to get that 136 or 126, 123 win to give the Kings a 1-0 lead on this series over the Warriors. Rucker?